Today is March 7 of 2019 and I want to compare some test strips that I have. These blood glucose test strips uh, expired back in two of 2018 so these are expired for one year. Then I have some that expired back in September of thir 2018. And then I have these which are still good for another year and they don't expire till 2020, March 31 of 2020. And I use a One Touch Ultra 2 test meter and I also use a AccuCheck Multi-Clicks which is good because it has a cartridge in it and you just twist the end and it pulls up a new needle every time and I believe it has uh, six needles in there. I'm going to go ahead, I already took the strips out just a few minutes ago and I'm going to go ahead and test it and compare it and see what the difference is. Okay, first one I'm trying is the one that expired exactly a year ago. And the funny thing is the code on all three of these is 25, so I have the exact same code on all of them. Okay, so the one that expired a year ago is coming out to 199. I'm going to try the one that expired six months ago. Okay. That one is 186. And now I'm going to try the current one. That one doesn't expire until uh, March of 2020. Okay, this one said my sugar today is 238. So there is quite a bit of difference. And also, even within the vials themselves, there usually is a difference uh, between each strip. Usually, like a number, a few numbers here and there. But these are um, quite a bit different. The one that expired a year ago is coming out to 199. And then the one that expired six months ago said it was 186. And then the current one, which doesn't expire until next year, it says it's 238. And um, my sugar is quite high. Actually, I started this intermittent fasting just five days ago. And it is supposed to help with my blood sugar levels, and hopefully it will. So that's it for my testing today. Have a great day.